What up, Jersey Heads? It is your man, Big Slim, B-Y-G-S-L-Y, double to the M. Back with the 74th edition of Slim Pickens, a.k.a. Getting Grails. Um, wanted to throw a wrench, so to say, in the mix. I've uh, been thinking about this for a little bit now, and... Um, and uh, I figured I would go ahead and start this video off with uh, this this installment of Slim Pickens with uh, two pickups uh, that I've recently that I recently picked up, and um, uh, and then I was going to uh, do something a little different uh, with like say Jersey reviews of some of the stuff that I already have that's already in my collection, uh, so. Um, I figured that I would do um, a baseball review, basketball review, and a football review, and I'll call it like blindfolded and Slim's Vault something. Uh, I, I don't know what to call it just yet. So um, basically what I'll do is I'll just go to, I have three rooms. That one is football, one's baseball, one's basketball. Um, I have, do have some hockey, but it's a... Uh, <laughs> you can count I probably this is probably how many hockey jerseys I have here total 10 um and, and most of them are Gretzky so uh, so I figured that I would do a um I would just do a uh review of just go blindfolded into one of my racks and just grab a jersey and then pick it out and whatever I do whatever I grab will be uh will be that particular that particular uh review uh so I got two pickups that I want to show that I have not shown yet uh, here on YouTube. And uh, here in the background, one of my uh, previous installments, I believe this is Getting Grails, or sorry, Slim Pickens, volume number 65. Coming up on two years now, there's me and my man Throwback King. And this is actually the uh, a video of uh, us. And uh, it's coming up here on two years now. There I am there uh, sporting, uh, uh, sporting the uh, Patrick Ewing rookie. And there's some video footage of the, uh, of the, of the Hall of Fame. Um, and, uh, also in this, in this video will also be, uh, M. Diddy, uh, and, uh, Mighty Fan 78. So, real quick, uh, shout out to my boy Seth. I am rocking the 2001-2002 Rashid Wallace, uh, Nike Authentic, uh, Portland Trailblazers, Mitchell and Ness, $5 fitted. I think I got it at the Mitchell and Ness, uh, store. Uh, the flagship store uh, some time ago in their little clearance five dollar fitted rack or five dollar fitted room i wish we had more footage of this man there's there's me uh big snack shooting around a little bit there's diddy i'll tell you what man diddy's got a little trigger on him i wish i still had some energy i wish i still had some here we are unveiling uh all four of my uh charles barkley uh 91 92 shooting stars Luckily, I had everybody here that could help me uh, help me unveil them. So that's uh, that's that's Diddy's boy. That's actually uh, we ended up having dinner at that. Uh, we ended up having dinner at that restaurant there. That was that was super cool. So it's hard to believe it's already been two years. It's already been almost two years. So so all right. So now nah, I'm I'm rambling on there. So I'll just let that run. But uh, I'll get into the uh, the pickups here. Uh, first things first. Again, shout out to my man MD. He is the creator and the CEO of Rivalry Sportswear. Uh, he, he made this piece for me. I asked for a mid-90s. 93, uh, 94, I guess, was the year that Chuck wore a captain patch here on this here particular jersey. This is a uh, the Rifleman Chuck Person. Sorry, I'm trying to talk over me. <laughs> so this is a uh, uh, this is beautiful, 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 my, the... Uh, Mesh material from the, 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 you know, Kevin, you know, anybody that owns a Kevin Garnett knows what, what I'm talking about here. Here's the, uh, the rivalry jock tag and, uh, Captain Patch, Wolves on the front and, uh, person on the back, not on a nameplate. Beautiful, beautiful jersey. I, uh, wanted to get something different other than KG, JR Ryder. Those would be almost one with Spud Webb. Um, those have been kind of the ones that people, those would have been ones that kind of people might have expected you to go with the JR Riders. And uh, so, speaking of oddball jerseys, here we go with another oddball. 
big big Eagles fan as you can see I got Vespa Polly rocking in the background hanging in the background I just recently wore that took me a little while to find a blank to do this but I was able to do it and my boys up at Sorrentino's was able to <laughs> I busted Mighty's ass playing some Tecmo Bowl shout out to throwback he looked 28 nothing I used the Lions I guess he used the Falcons thinking Dion it might be <laughs> And here is, and there's me standing right where I'm standing now. I gotta finish the video when I got home. So, but uh, it took me a little while to find a Nike authentic blank to do this correctly, and I wanted to, to get this done correctly. So as soon as I found it, I got it. I got it uh, shipped. Got it. I, I actually shipped this straight from the seller to uh, to the place that did the work for me. And um, and when it showed up, um, they hit me up and emailed me, told me. Uh, they got the pan. They got the Panthers. So you know the the people that do the Panthers, the, the Dazzle Twill and all that, and the Double Stitch and all that. So this is the last year that Reggie White was in the NFL. Um, he he took one year off and then came back and played one season in 2000 with the Panthers. So this is a 2000 Nike Authentic Reggie White. Dave, if you're watching this, yes, we know you have a game used one. Reggie probably delivered it to you. Himself sat down, signed it, had a meal, and all that, right? <laughs> Shout out to my buddy Dave and Marco. Dave, you got a nasty collection. But here you go. Here's again, this is the 2000 Reggie White Nike Jock Tag. So I wanted to complete all of Reggie's teams that, uh, that he played for. And, um, and I have done that. Shout out to Big John. This is uh, this was Big John's jersey. We did a trade, the, two, the 1993 Reggie White, and um, and then I just had this happen to have this hanging here too because I did a picture. Here's the '92 career run Reggie White. So got that. All right, so so um, gonna go dig out some uh, go go dig out some jerseys and uh, let's see what. Uh, Let's see what uh, we come up with, and uh, I'll be right back. Uh. All right, Jersey Heads, we're back with the next, uh, well, the first uh, attempt at doing what I'm going to call um, going blindfolded into Slim's vault, and uh, I've talked this over with a couple people, talked this over with uh, uh, Nostalgia Boy. Mighty Fan 78 talked over with a couple of people and um, and figured that maybe this would be something a little different. Uh, so basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to do one from um, I'm going to do one from hockey, one from baseball and one from foot or not hockey, one from football, one from baseball, one from basketball. I'll just go blindfolded into one of my racks here, this, uh, this rack behind me. I'll go blindfolded literally and just 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 kind of go right down the line and just and whatever I pick uh you know I'll just I'll do a review on that whether I've showed it in a previous uh video before or or not and um and uh and we'll just uh we'll just go from there uh so let's uh let's let's see what happens let's see what we got here okay alrighty we went with the got the uh, Johnny Unitas uh, Southland 1973 San Diego Chargers so that'll be the first one that'll be one, one, one for football now let's go pick out a basketball right back alright y'all alright y'all we're back with the uh, NBA portion of uh, or the basketball portion of of my uh, surprise pick whatever it may be um Got a got a long closet here, and I'm just going to go in one side, and just and whatever I grab, I will, I will do a review on that. So, uh, so just going to just kind of reach back here and see what we got. Oh, dig 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 dig. Oh, alrighty, let's see what we got. Okay, we got the uh, Detroit Pistons. Bob Lanier, new tags. I don't even remember what year this is. This is a 71-72. Alrighty, let's go pick up go pick out a baseball and I'll do reviews on. Do do reviews on. 
All right, Jersey Heads, we are in the third part. <laughs> this this part of this room is actually isn't sectioned off. This was actually my old, one of my old bedrooms uh, that I had in the place that I'm renting. Um, so I um, so this this part here is actually just sectioned off with a sheet. But this is actually my baseball my baseball vault. So I'm going to just go like I said blindfolded in here and let's uh let's see what I uh, let's see what I end up pulling out. Okay. Uh, looking up, looking up, looking up, not looking, not looking, <laughs> not looking, alrighty, and whatever jersey is in my hand, <laughs> Mitchell Ness is getting ready to drop this, again, the Jackie Satin, alrighty, alright, let's get into it, alright guys, I'm back, and uh, I'm going to go ahead and uh, actually end up just kind of rewinding, Rewind this, rewind this jersey or run this video again. Go back to the beginning of it. Again, shout out to uh, uh, Throwback King and uh, M Diddy and Mighty Fan for doing that, uh, for doing this, for doing this video with me. Hard to believe, like I said, already hard, hard to believe, already been almost ten or two years. Uh, next month it'll be two years. So I got the jerseys out. Obviously, you saw I, I kind of unveiled them, showed what I was going to show. So I'll go ahead and show you uh, and do re uh, review vids on the three that I picked out. So, all right, let's get into it. We'll go ahead and uh, we'll start with the we'll start with the football first. And uh, it is the Southland, a Southland authentic size fifty two, which I don't think it's a fifty two. It's a it's yeah, anybody that knows these Southland jerseys, they run they run small. And they have they have weird cuts, but I just I had to have a, a you know I just Mitchell Ness never made one of these Peter why not? But went ahead and decided to go ahead and get get this one. I saw it anyways. It is a 1973 Southland Authentic. I have unveiled this before. It's been three four years ago, five years ago maybe when I got this. And um, so it is a, a again a 1973. The iconic bolts on the sleeves there. Uh, it's um, totally separate material, double stitch bolts on top. Johnny Unitas on the back, Knight Unitas is on the nameplate, number 19. Ironically, he won one game. One game he won as a Charger, and it was against OJ Simpson and the Bills. Did a little research on that. I think he was one and four as a starter. Chargers were not good that year. Dan Fouts is rookie year, by the way. So, there you go. That's my football review. The Southland, I guess I could show the, is there a jock tag? Uh, there is not. Just uh, just the just the neck, which might be kind of hard to see. Size 52, which probably is a 48, and no Rob. Shout out to Nostalgia Boy. No, you're not getting it. Oh, shout out to Mitchell and Ness and the Mitchell and Ness flagship store. Looks like they're going to be making this again, but I got the Peter run already, so I am good. Don't, don't, uh, this is a, uh, a 3X, uh, Jackie Satin, Jackie Robinson, Brooklyn Dodgers satin jersey. Not, uh, really a whole lot to see here. Just a beautiful, beautiful jersey, nice material. I wish it was, uh, taken better care of by the previous, uh, the previous, um, Looks like it'd been ran through the dryer, dryer as well. He's got that little lint, you know, the little thing, the lint thing he's on there, but it's still in great shape though, especially for its age. No stains or nothing like that. So, so here you go, the 1949, I believe. I'm brain farting on exactly what year it is, but here you go. Anyways, and I don't believe this has. Sorry, it does have a jock tag on it, but it does not have a year on it. There's the jock tag, just the, just the uh, Mitchell Ness. Cooper's on collection. So there you go. All right, got one more, and then uh, we will wrap this thing up. There you go. It's kind of a weird jersey you don't see too too often, and I, I got this some time ago. It is new with tags. Original Peter Run. There you go. There's a uh, tag still hanging on it. You know. Yes, Rob. The tags are still on it. It is a 72, 73, if I'm not mistaken, 71, 72, 71, 72. Shout out to Big Baby. 
Jersey Kings Network. Glad to see you making videos again. Shout out to you for getting that Steve Smith. The Bob Lanier. Detroit Pistons. Usually when you see the Lanier's pop up, you know, most of the time you just see the Mitchell Ness ones pop up that, uh, <clears throat> you know, the 83-84 the uh, Milwaukee Bucks jerseys. But uh, but uh, but I'm uh, happy to have this one here. Here you go, 71-72. Size 56, which will probably fits your boy pretty good. I'm in a 52-54 older run. Depending on what it, depending on what jersey it is, but uh, but uh, but I am happy to 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 have this in a decent size, you know, because I outgrew or the out the sixties have outgrown me somewhat. So so all right, guys. Well, I will uh, I will go ahead and uh, wrap this up. There you go. The uh, <laughs> But now I got the Barkley and the uh, Shooting Stars uh, and the Shooting Stars uh, Mitchell Ness uh, jacket. So uh, yeah, so uh, combo wombo. Shout out to Mighty Fan. Shout out to everybody in the Kings of Throwbacks and everybody that follows me on my group, Jerseys, Kicks, and Lids. And your boy is finally, finally, according to Mitchell Ness. And everybody in the group that's uh, follow me on Instagram at B Y G S L Y double M on Instagram. And uh, look at this guy, he thinks he's cool, <laughs> but uh, epic, iconic, iconic visit, man. Great, great visit. One of the best jersey meetups ever, to be honest with you. And now we're probably going to get some. Oh, look at this, a cut right to Philly, look at right, right, right in front of the Rocky statue. Shout out to my boy Neiman. Hopefully he'll watch this. He's actually the one filming so Mighty and myself could actually uh, do the uh, do the video. That's the day that we ran the Rocky Stairs. So that was a, uh, this is crazy, crazy video. So this is, this is also a cool, cool video. So, all right, guys. Well, uh, I am your boy, Big Slim BYG. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up. And uh, I've done enough rambling. And uh, I'm going to try to get something out maybe like every week. I'll go digging into the vault and see what jersey I can just... I'll just randomly pull out like when I like for example like I told when I talked to nostalgia boy the other night I told him what I was thinking about and then I went and kind of dug my arm in and when I went and dug my arm into my vault uh when I went and dug my arm into my vault what ended up coming out was the what 72 72 Paul Popovich Chicago Cubs road gray so that would have been if I would have done it that night that would have been the jersey so it's kind of cool to just go just go and blindfold it. I'm going to try to figure out a name for it. Blind and Slim's Vault, maybe Dark and Slim's Vault, something. I don't know. But uh, in the meantime, I am your man BYG, and I will talk to you uh, in the next vid. Thanks for your support, man. One.